Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie Farming in the Philippines. Well, it's coming on to half past six. And look at this, rain, 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 rain. So, there's only one thing to do, I've fed my babies, is go inside and have some breakfast and make ourselves happy. Hello, darling. Hello. Oi, oi. Hello. Good morning. Good G'day. Yes. Right, guys, so Chick's making up. What are you making, baby doll? Bitter gourd. And... With egg, you know our leftovers from the, what did we make? Flan, the whites, the egg whites of the egg that mm -hmm. we made as a flan. And then I mix with the fresh one. The fresh eggs. That's uh, cracked, that has cracked. Wow. Right guys, well as you know, we've got bacon down in the fridge and we've got to keep turning it every day. So Saturday we're going to have some bacon. Now someone contacted Chick and said, one of the local people, and said, we're making bacon as well now and um, so she said, all right, give us, a, give us a test packet. So she brought, brought a kilo, hun? Yeah. Brought a kilo? Mm. So she brought a kilo, and um, the price was very, very low. How much was it? 300 a kilo. 300 a kilo. Now, our, our bacon is um, 1,000 pesos a kilo, our bacon. So this bacon is 300, so we had, to, we had to have a test to see what it looks like. Are you ready? What did you say? <laughs> Voila. So, I'm gonna open this one up in front of you. Now, I'll put a clip, before we go any further, before we go any further, I'll put a clip right here on what we made last time, okay? Wait, it's coming, wait. Right guys, so I'll move now onto the tails. So I'm doing the tail section. Have a look at this little baby here. The tails is what we call the belly pork, okay? Have a look at this here, look. Look at that. Is that perfect layers or what? Look at that. Meat fat, meat fat, meat fat. That is the perfect layers, guys. Absolute perfect. Look at it. God, I tell you, that is going to be bloody good bacon. You know, there's nothing like your own pork, mate. Seriously. Honest God, I say it a thousand times, but seriously, this is the way to go. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Lots of loveliness. Okay, so that's the bacon that Chick Chick and I make up. So let's have a look at this one here. Open up, baby. You ready? Okay. What is it, darling? It looks like it's just hunks of fat. Like super thin What the strips. fuck is that? Super thin strips. Is it cured or is it it's just, um, is it thin strips? It's not even um, cured. It doesn't look like we have to cook so we know if it's, it's cured or not. It looks like it's all the, um, it's got a little bit of a, a curing smell to it. Mm-hmm. It's like the shaved ham we used to get years ago, remember guys? Like, um... Wow, oh, look at that. I think this is all the leftovers or something like that. Off bits. Off, off bits. Well, there you go. The Filipinos have another word, and they call it the off bits. How good is that? So this is all the off bits, darling. By the looks, yeah. So this is all the off bits. Okay, we call it the leftovers in Australia. But the Pinots, they've got a scientific word and they call it the off bits. All right. All right, guys, so that's what we got. This is the local bacon. So you can see what you get for 300 peso is this. This is what you get, 300 peso. So I'm going to throw some of this underneath the griller just to see what happens, okay? So then you can say, William, you make some fucking good bacon, mate. You really do. And them locals can learn a lot from you, a hell of a lot. But point is, it would never happen. That's right, you and I both know that. Right, I'm gonna throw this onto the tray and stick it underneath the grill. Well, it's still raining, looks like it's set in for the day. Okay, so let's have a look, shall we? Right, so this is the bacon, the Filipino bacon, that's been put underneath the griller under high heat. Okay, this is a manoir. 
This is the Filipino bacon that's been cooked in the pan. A non-stick pan. So it's got nice colour to it, which is quite good. Quite good. This is the underneath the griller. The gorilla. So we'll go in and we'll do the taste comparison. I'll turn that off. Okay, so this is from the pan. Now this is this is straight natural. There's no pepper, salt, nothing. Just straight, straight up, bitch. Get it off and give it to me. Right, let's try. No pure at all. Why is chewy? It's brown. It reminds me, reminds me um, of the hotels when you go into Thailand and um, their baking used to be the same. And I always thought that they must stick it in the deep fryer or something like that, you know, I thought, geez, they definitely don't know how to cook bacon. But now I know why, it's, it's a supply. So um, there you go, guys. That's the local bacon, as in from a local supplier that they make so um, the dogs will have a nice feed today not being rude or anything but um, it's certainly not um, to my palate what do you think baby it's not cured at all I mean it smells um... to me it looks like they thinly sliced all the off-cut bits of meat that's been left over they put it in a barrel with some liquid smoke and uh, you can smell a light liquid smoke there yeah, you can smell it smoke. but um, that's it it's not um, it's not cured well, put it this way, they say it's cured. It must be for just a day. Because um, there you go. So there you go, guys. That is a comparison of the Aussie farming in the Philippines of bacon made in the Philippines, made at Panabo on the Aussie farm, and the local bacon made where, darling? I don't know. I don't know. So it's made here locally anyway. So the difference is 300 pesos a kilo. You get what you pay for. And that, my friends, is what you get. That is what you get. Now this is uncut, this is straight out the packet. So if you want any bacon from my lovely Chick Chick and I, right, some good Aussie bacon, we got some British eye bacon, and we got some belly bacon, and we have it nice and thick slices. So if you want any, contact us down below on the Facebook or on the Hotmail, Panabo, Homestead, Deli. Deli. All right, guys, catch you later. Don't forget, watch our videos up here from my other subscribers that you'll see today on the show. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.